the moon. The moon. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Al. So, I have a Timo haul for you guys. I received two packages, one on Saturday and the other one on today. I'm out here on the porch. We outside because it's absolutely gorgeous out here. It was really, really nice earlier, but you know how it be looking when you get off work. The sun be going, or not the sun be going down, but that weather change on you real quick. I'm trying to open this without having to go into, having to go into without having to go get something to open it up with. But, um, I'm struggling. Because, see, when sometimes they be looking like they just fold the stuff up and then just put a bunch of tape around it. Which wouldn't be a problem if I actually had something to open it up with. All right. Okay, so I think I finally got it open. But this is the second bag I wanted to show you. I just wanted to make sure I got it open. This is the first bag, which is already open. So, let me get all this stuff out here and unpackage it so you don't have to deal with the rustling and going on, and I'll be back. Alrighty. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's me, Al. So, in today's video, I have a tweet to... Here I go again. I have a Timu haul. Timu. 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 I have a Timu haul for you guys. So, um, let's go ahead and just jump right into it. So, the, in, I swear y'all, I told you, when I be on Timu, some of my items be intentional and some of them just be like random. So, um, my first random item that I picked up is this, uh, grater right here. So, this is actually supposed to grate your vegetables like your carrots and your cucumbers and the skin or the peel is supposed to drop down into or supposed to stay in here so you don't end up with um, cucumber on the floor which is where most of mine end up at my the peeling anyway so I bought this I thought this was, would be like a nifty little kitchen gadget of course I have to open it up and wash it out and I will let you guys know how it worked and if it worked So the next item I picked up and I already took it out the bag and it is this, um, look, I'm being nosy, y'all. It's this gadget right here. Now this is supposed to be like a, um, oh my God, what did I buy? This is supposed to be like a, um, power washer. So you attach it to your water hose and it's supposed to be like a, power wash type situation um when i squeeze this right here i don't know what this button does but when i squeeze the water came out so i guess they test it first to make sure that it worked and um that's what happened with that i don't know how well this is going to work i think the holes the nozzle that i already have on the holes is probably going to work much better than this but it wasn't that expensive so i went ahead and picked it up it came with an attachment in it which I seem to have lost but it came like with a little o-ring or something and I lost that but I don't know I will try it I don't see me really using it and I definitely don't see Bay using it <laughs> he'll be like what you buy so I picked that up then um, I also got these grow bags now um, my husband bought me a grow bag from Timu and it was a 10 gallon bag so I was like, okay, he bought me one just to be buying it when he purchased something from Timu. So now I was like, okay, well, let me go ahead and get some more. I'm so glad that I bought some from Amazon because I did end up picking up like five, seven gallons from um, Amazon for like $16. Because I think I might have ordered the wrong size. I think these might be the three gallon I mean, they're still cute and they can still be used to put like flowers in or something, but this grow bag is too small to do anything that 
I am currently doing out here but I will save them for later I did buy two of them so there's always next year I also picked up this purse right here and it is so cute I didn't think it would be this cute it is really cute and this is how it looks in the front and this is how it looks in the back and then this is the strap for it and it's a dupe for some bag which is not coming to me right now I'm not sure what the dupe is but if y'all seen um, if y'all seen it then y'all know exactly what I'm talking about but this is the dupe for that bag and it's actually really really cute this that great um, Saturday morning got to run to the grocery store type bag got to run some errands type bag where you don't want your bag to be too heavy you just need your essentials in there so you can go get what you need to get done um, this is what the inside looks like but like I said the Duke the name for it the Duke escapes me um, I'm not really don't really care about these little strings that's hanging off is the way they sewed it but um, you can just easily get a pair of scissors and just nip that off but this is so cute because I need another purse right but yeah really really cute bag can't wait to sport it people don't think I got on the real deal but I don't speaking of not the real deal or dupes I also picked up this perfume and y'all know I already opened it because I couldn't wait to smell it this uh, is by Jean Miss but this is the dupe for that replica perfume so um, if you see this bottle now you know what I'm talking about this is a dupe for the regular rec regular for the replica perfume and um, I think they sell it at Sephora um, this has tobacco leaf, spicy notes, those are the top notes, the middle notes of vanilla, cacao, and tonka bean, and the base note is dried fruit and woody notes. Y'all, this, I think I messed up the sprayer because it does not come with a top. I don't know if they made a mistake, but mine did not come with a top and so when I thought I was pulling off the top I was actually pulling off the nozzle you spray with so I don't know why it didn't come with a top but it smells so good this is a really good fall scent it's nice and woody and earthy and uh, it almost smells because I did go into Ulta and I did smell this it almost smells like the um it almost smells just like it. I mean, it's a, I think it's called By the Fireside or By the Fireplace, something like that. Um, but this is the dupe for that. And this is Miss Jean Miss. Um, yeah, I like this one. It's really nice and earthy. Um, I also picked up the dupe for Tom Ford. Hmm. I think some of that perfume might have got in my my throat. I did pick up some of the um, dupe by Tom Ford, and this is <coughs> this is bitter peach. Hold on, y'all. All right, I'm back. Better than ever. All right, so um, like I was saying, this is the Tom Ford um, dupe. It's this one is bitter peach by. Biotic. This one, I don't really know. I don't really know how I love it in the bottle. And yesterday when I sprayed it, it gave me a little bit of peach uh, smell. But if I spray it now, it's it's really strong. It's really masculine. It's. I mean, I know most of Tom Ford's. Um, perfumes and colognes are unisex but see it gives you that peach and then it goes away like if they can get that peach if the peach 
if the peach scent was more forward, this would be bomb. But I think they kind of put it in the back as like a um, bottom note. Oh, wait a minute. Wait. Okay, hold on. I might be onto something here. Maybe I just need to let it aerate, you know, on my skin or whatever. But, okay. Okay. This is turning out to be nice. Mmm. Okay, maybe I was wrong, y'all. Maybe I was wrong. This one is absolutely good. And I can still smell this one. This one is a good fall scent, good winter scent. This one is a good summer scent. And then they also have, um, I think the one that this company makes is called Sour Cherry. I put that in my cart, but y'all know it was gone. But the thing that I do like about Timu is if you have something in your cart and it sells out, when they get it back in, they will put it back in your cart. And also, if your um, delivery doesn't arrive on time, on the date they give you between like the 17th and the 11th, if it comes on the 12th, they do give you a $5 credit. So shout out to T-Move for that because, I mean, we like be waiting on our packages. I know I do. All right, so um, I think that was all I got out of this bag. I'm going to go ahead and put everything back in to this bag or put everything away and then I'm gonna come back and we're gonna start on the next purchase and this one I have been waiting for so all right guys so this is my second team order I'm not going to do two videos I'm gonna go ahead and just get this all done in one video so this is the a tiara oh it's nice and heavy too this is a tiara that I ordered for my daughter, she is going to prom on Saturday. She is graduating this year. I'm so excited. Shout out to me and her, but mainly me. Ooh, I'm so glad school is going to be over for this girl. And that's our last one that we had to get through school. So, um, but I bought this tiara to go with her prom dress, y'all. And then I'm going to do her hair. Look at that. It is going to be so cute and i love it because it has some weight to it because my daughter has a lot of hair and i mean a lot so i'm going to be doing her hair on thursday evening and getting her um all ready for prom but that was cute and then i also picked her up this purse right here from timo and like i said i'm so glad everything came on time because her prom is on saturday and so she needed a little purse to go with her um, her dress. And we went all through like the stores in the area we went shopping. We went all up and through them stores and stopping at every little side store. Couldn't find nothing. So I saw this on Timu and I thought that this was really cute. And it comes with the strap. And so you get this strap right here um, and then you put it to I think like this one so you can also get two straps and I think it goes well it doesn't matter how it goes this is hers I want her to open it I just wanted to show you guys I'm sure that she is going to come and have me do this for her anyway so but I just wanted to show you guys what it is. Here come Bay. He hauling ass down the street. I don't know why he driving so fast. But here he come. Let me talk to him real quick, y'all. And I'll be right back. Alright, so I also picked her up this variable speed. Uh, it's a nail file. I do want to see what it looks like. Even though I want her to open it. I do want to see the quality of it. Oh, it came with the, I didn't think it came with it. Came with these two. All the little things to do your nails with. She is really big into doing her nails now. So now she has a little nail kit like she a whole professional. And it even comes with a USB port. So that's neat. Am I missing something? I feel like something else fell out and I missed it. But... That's for her. 
Now, if mommy can just get it back in the box. Come on, woman. Okay, that's a good quality for, you know, if you do home your nails at home, um, or if you have a daughter like I do, and she's into that whole nail thing right now, this is like a really cute set, and it was really inexpensive. Um, I can't remember the price, y'all, but I know it wasn't that expensive. Um, let me see. I also got, and um, this is supposed to be my Mother's Day outfit, weather permitting, but I picked up this dress. I finally got me another article of clothing. If it wasn't for my husband stopping me, my whole closet would be full of Timu clothes. Because he was like, babe, we have nowhere else to put your clothes. So he's telling me to purge, and I'm like, but I just did. And he was like, well, you need to purge again. Whatever, dude. It's like, no. But he's probably right. I just, I don't feel like it. I don't, I don't feel like it. Hmm. It's got a little scent to it, like um, nail polish or something, but I thought this is so cute. It's a shirt dress. I got it in a... I got this in a 2X. Oh, yeah, that's right. I did. Okay. I got it in a 2X because of the fact that it didn't look like it had any stretch to it. Because of this, I think it's polyester or polyester blend. So it doesn't have any stretch. So that's why I got a 2X because I like my clothes to fit. Um, depending on what it is, I like my clothes to fit a little loose on me. I don't really like my clothes to fit all snug and, and tight. But this is how the bottom looks. I'm going to try it on for y'all. Or I'm going to at least insert a picture so y'all can see exactly what I'm talking about. But I thought that this was so cute. And it's really lightweight. And um, I also got these to go with it. I picked these. I got these tennis shoes right here to go with it. I love these little mesh shoes. They are so light and comfortable and just so easy to wear. I got these in a 43. I want to say that's an 11. Because the last time I ordered a pair of shoes from, it wasn't Timu, but it was somewhere else. And I got a 42, which is a 10. It fits so tight. So, I was like, okay, just to be on the safe side, let me go ahead and get me an 11. So, this is either a 10 and a half or an 11. And it don't even look like it. Because, you know how sometimes 11 can make you look like, make your feet look like you got on a boat or something. But I thought this is going to be so cute together. Look at that. So that's going to be my Mother's Day outfit. Like I said, um, I will insert a picture of me wearing it so you can see how the outfit looks. But that's pretty much it, y'all. That's all I got from Timu. Now, I'm not going to say I'm not going to get more stuff because Timu be calling me. But um, that's all I got for today's Timu haul. So, I will see you guys in another video. It could be another team move haul. Just, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. All right, guys. So, I'm going to go ahead and let you go. I ain't going to hold you. If you are new to the channel, welcome to the channel. If you see something you like, go ahead and smash that subscribe button. If you're coming back to see me again, welcome back. I appreciate you guys. I love seeing you. And I hope you like seeing me as well. All right, guys. So, I will talk to you in the next video. See you then. Bye.